This is the 11.01 starting time. Players for this match are from the United States, Tiger Woods. <laughs> Woods for position off the tee of this 450 yard par four. Good plan, poorly executed. Well, Stephen Ames was hoping for errant shots from Woods when uh, he was popped into the field. Linda gave her the reasoning that it was the last one in. Anything can happen, especially where he's hitting the ball. Well, anything can happen if there's a squirrel up there. Obviously, I mean, <laughs> geez, how about that for an opener? Very interesting that Tiger worked on a draw on just about every single shot on the range this morning and then opens up, you know, starting it down the right and it didn't come back. How about Tiger hitting a tree and still out driving Stephen Ames? And in great position there at the first. No need to fire Tiger up. Now this is for par. And Woods will have uh, two putts to win this opening hole. Just concede it. Okay. So Woods immediately goes one up. Just a moment ago, Tiger Woods knocked it in here to 17 feet. This for a birdie putt to beat Stephen Ames and go two up after two holes. I think Tiger might be a little uh, annoyed at the comments that Stephen Ames made about his uh, play so far this season with two wins to his credit. Oh. 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 Augusta revisited. Yeah, I, I uh, think this lie is pretty marginal for getting there. It's not really bad, but uh, that's the five wood. It's downwind, and Manny's hit it pretty well, and it's on a good line. <laughs> I love his mannerisms. I mean, to, to get oh. that power into that shot from that rough is incredible. 253 yards that was, folks. A little down breeze, but that was thick rough. That was the sort of stuff that I might just take an eight iron out there and lay it up. Back over at the third, Tiger Woods from 21 feet for Eagle. Actually has two putts to win the hole and go three up. Stephen Ames was just outside him, about three or four feet. Made par. Ooh. It's a bit of a lag. <laughs> well, what a nightmare start for Stephen Ames. I don't think I'd have given him that one. I made him, I'd have made him earn that, I believe. Could create um, just a little bit of a flyer or a ball that doesn't want to stop very quickly. From this angle to that whole location, that could be problematic. Oh, Played yeah. it well. What a nice shot. That's more divot than we saw him at any time on the driving range, huh? Stephen Ames has only been on the golf course for 40 minutes and he's, that's like boxing, isn't it? Four rounds and you're, you're four down. Tiger obviously still with a birdie putt here, could go five up after five holes. Stephen might not uh, open his mouth so readily next year. It's thoroughly uh, getting it handed to him right now. The golfing gods are always watching, aren't they? You make a comment like that, it comes back to bite you. Well, what he said really isn't that far yeah. offline, you know, I mean, off base. I mean, Tiger has been hitting it all over the place, and, you know, but he wins doing it. That's the thing. He wins tournaments. Uh, he's just got, he's got that gift, that, that intangible that allows him to score. But you know what? The most important thing in match play is it doesn't matter. It's the score. It's winning the hole. It doesn't matter how you do it. Does it? Exactly. That's why we all thought it was a strange one back there at the third. That's the, the, Get him the guy who hits it all over the golf course and, and has got the, the willpower to get the thing in the hole, chip it in, whatever. They're the most dangerous match players. Well, it's like trying to play Seve in match play. I mean, it was brutal. He'd hit it all over the place. You'd think you'd have an advantage and then he'd rip your heart out. Five under three five usually going to put you in a pretty good spot as you head to the sixth team <laughs> and Woods is five up. Man, we have not seen somebody go five up through five. I don't believe in the prior 448 matches of this event so far. 310 yards all the way and you can see there he's going straight over the trees with the driver using the up tee. Well, oh, that looks right at it. You can tell when he twirls that club <laughs> that he likes it. Oh. 
Ah, oh, not again, Tiger. Goodness. Uh, especially a guy like Tiger Woods, and it's backfired on Stephen Ames, and he didn't mean for this to happen to him. Uh, he, he, he almost recanted. He did recant. He said, oh, I don't want to say that, but uh, too late. I've already said it, you know. Anything can happen where Tiger's been hitting it, and it's, it's coming back to haunt him. And uh, I think it fired Tiger up. Six up. Start running the bathwater. <laughs> <laughs> Tiger Woods moves to the seventh. Third and eight. Easy to settle this ball down quickly. <laughs> this little putt now to go eight up after eight, and uh, that would be seven birdies in eight holes. Yeah. yeah, seven under through eight, you know, when you just look at regular starts on tour. And Tiger Woods with a par putt coming up to win the match here at 10. Hit it 312 yards off the tee, but in the right rough. No one has won this hole from that spot as of yet. Tiger trying to do it and win overall. And because he is dormy, as they say, he wins with a have as well. Either way, it's uh, it's a record-setting result, really, isn't it? Seven and six, the best winning margin so far in this event. The eighth edition of the Accenture. Knockout punch. Woods not only survives and advances, but basically destroy Stephen Ames today. And, uh, you don't even want to call this a learning experience. It's just an experience you wish you didn't have. Yeah, I think anybody, I don't think anybody would have wished it on today. Uh, Tiger played exceptionally well. I think the score showed it in the front nine. He was uh, seven, seven birdies, he had two pars. Yeah, it was a rough nine for Tiger, you know. No, he played very well. Um, he struck the ball nicely with the driver and also with his irons very well. You're the consummate match player. Have you ever played this well in a match and uh, won a match uh, nine and eight? No, I have not. Um, the best I think I've ever done is eight and seven, uh, but uh, certainly not not nine and eight. That was uh, that was uh, a little bit of fun out there. You seem to be on a mission from the very first tee. Uh, was there some kind of inspiration other than you love match play and head-to-head -head golf? Oh yeah, there certainly was. Yeah, <laughs> Stephen provided it. So um, yeah, definitely. So Stephen suggested that maybe you weren't driving the ball just in all the right places, and I think you showed him all the right places today. I think I did all right today. Yes, um, I think he understands now. Tiger, thanks. A little history setting. Uh, the best, uh, the biggest win here prior to this was seven and six. So uh, great golf. Thank you very much. Thanks, Judy.